love heavy ponte. Okay, so I want to tell you about my obsession with this fabric. <laughs> um, about a year ago, I went, we went school shopping for my daughter who's, um, she's 15 this year, so she would have been almost 15 last year. And we stopped into, I think, Charlotte Russe, one of those stores in the mall. And they had a ton of shorts, skirts, pants, anything you could think of for bottoms made out of this delicious fabric. And I was all over it. I was digging in the pants and looking at the um, tags to see what the fiber content was on it and stretching it, looking at it. I'm sure people thought I was really weird. Um, but I decided that it was Ponty because that's what it looked like to me. And the content was rayon, nylon, spandex. I was like, well, all the Ponties that I've seen are poly rayon spandex. So now I gotta find some of this nylon rayon spandex. So Mary Beth and I went on the hunt and we did. We found a couple of our suppliers have it. We love it. Um, the nylon and rayon together, it's just a little bit of a different feel than the polyester. And I've heard some people say that it keeps, the nylon keeps the rayon from pilling. I don't know if that's true. I'm just repeating what I heard. Um, it's a double knit, it means that there's two um, layers of fabric that, uh, two knitted layers that are woven together. It does, it's a 320 GSM fabric. I don't know what that equates to in ounces, but um, double knits tend to be um, more structured. Um, they have two-way stretch. There is a tiny bit of vertical stretch, but it's mostly your stretch is two-way. You would um, use this fabric for pants, skirts, dresses that you want structure, like a wiggle dress. This would be good for a wiggle dress. You want some structure to it. Um, pencil skirts, um, tops that uh, would have structure like a peplum top. This would be a good top for that. Can you think of anything else? Yeah, Beth Dara made that, that um, sweater. It was a, I can't remember the name of it. Anyway, it was a swagger sweater was it? Huh? Swagger sweater? No. But she did. She made a sweater out of it that Holly made the same one, and it it almost looks like a suit coat made out of the ponte. So Holly and Beth each made a sweater, and Mary Beth can't remember which. Of course I can. <laughs> Help me, Holly. She can't remember which um, pattern it was, but they made it out of the ponte, and it looked more structured, almost like a suit coat. So. You could, you know, depending on what you pick, the Ponty's going to, to change the pattern. That's what's so cool about making your own clothes and picking your own fabrics and understanding how a fabric um, is going to lay when you decide to make something out of it. So very structured. You can even tell um, on the mannequin picture and in my hands how nice and structured it is. And do you want to 